Hi, this is Kyle with Kirksville Web Design. Today I would like to talk to you all about using animations in Google Sites, how to embed or insert those animations. And we're going to be using a particular platform which is uh, producing or providing tons of, of great animations uh, for free, or they also have various pricing plans for uh, professional and commercial use. Now, let, let me start off here with this template. So I've created this, this new template, I think it was last week here, September, uh, week of the September 12th or whatever it is. And uh, so this template is a portfolio. And you'll see on this portfolio, I mean, right off the bat, what's grabbing your attention, this fun little, you know, graphic and animation. So I've put these in a couple places, mostly on, on each page of this template to kind of show off this capability of using animations. Now, previously you may have used animations as just embedded GIF, GIF images, and those can be quite slow uh, to load and they can be look funky sometimes and, you know, just because of the rendering with those types of images, it can can look bad or look amateur or you know kitschy or whatever. So yeah, you can see these various animations shown off here in this template, which is available. If you want to buy it? Um, okay, so let's talk about then this platform called Lottie Files. Let me quickly go to the home page just so you get impression of where you're at. Okay, well this is the dashboard. Let me kind of go to the home page just so you're familiar with this this website and what they're doing. Lightweight, scalable animations for your websites and apps. So this includes Google Sites. We can use these animations on Google Sites and actually quite easy. Let's go then to an animation for example. Uh, and I was just searching for like, you know, free uh, animations that were red because uh, that went with my with my theme and my template. So here we have a particular animation, right? And uh, like it. So what should we do? We go to um, uh, the embedding options. I guess here is where the uh, you open up this side panel for embedding and handoff, I guess they call that. And uh, you'll see we are using this Lottie JSON format here. Uh, at least that's what I've been using. Maybe other things are supported. But when I do that, and I just copy this uh, web code snippet, and I go to my Google site, get into edit mode here real quick, working on pages here in the background about animations, just kind of give support, and this is part of that support, you know, for this template is helping people understand how to uh, embed these Lottie file animations. So as part of a tutorial, essentially. So you have, I have one here, I have one there. Let's start off, you know, I have already copied the code to my clipboard. So it's waiting there, there for me to post. And in case you didn't know, expand this embedding uh, window. I'm not sure if I can make the font. I can't make the font bigger with zooming in. Might help. So yeah, script source, JavaScript, and then this uh, this Lottie code uh, with uh, using this JSON uh, code example. You have some things to also customize: background uh, color, speed of the animation. You make it double time. You know, if you want to do. Uh, two times as fast or 0 0.5 times. I think those are also things you can toggle with uh, the Lottie files uh, in your dashboard. Um, so there's tons of other options if you upgrade uh, your plan and your, um, your tier with that uh, platform. But even with free, you can do quite a lot. So style, I think you can just leave this or you can just delete or you could delete it out. Uh, or say 100% or whatever, or height. Maybe I'll just get rid of the height. I don't think it's necessary. Looping, okay, good. Uh, I think one 
it's, I also kind of like uh, made it align, align center. Here it's aligning automatically to the left within this uh, text box here. So it's always gonna go to the left. And uh, let me zoom back out. Yeah, so you'll see that image there. And if I make this smaller, I believe it scales, yeah. Get smaller, you know, smaller little icon animation. Or it'll look basically is, is responsive to grow to fit the uh, size of the box to, to a degree. I mean, it's not going to get huge. I think you want huge animations, but <laughs> it might be kind of distracting. Okay, so that's uh, the example. Let me see if I can align this thing. A simple line center. Is that it? Or margin. Margin auto. One of those will do it, surely. Yes, it did. All right. Yeah, test out your little HTML and CSS skills. I'm no master there, but that, that gets the job done. All right. So there you have it. That's embedding uh, from Lottie files and animation. And uh, yeah, then you can just drag this and, and use this, copy this, put this on any page that you might need. Uh, yeah. All right, so that's it. Uh, I hope you enjoy playing around with this, uh, this aspect of web design and, and using this uh, fun new feature uh, on your uh, websites, on your Google sites. Thanks a lot for tuning in. See you next time.